Hey guys, it is Pokey Ro. It's so nice to see you guys again. I know I've been a little bit of MIA lately. Um, just a lot of stuff going on with my family and also with work. And then it's been it's been just a crazy heat wave in the Midwest that just kind of makes me feel blah. So haven't really been in the zone and the game. Honestly, if I'm being honest, I have just been really crazily playing Stardew Valley on my Switch. Um, I kind of hyper fixated on that for a little bit, so that's kind of where I've been. Kind of took a mental health break for a little bit, if you will. But yeah, so we are back today. Um, I When I picked this up, I actually have been meaning to post for like, I would say a whole week. Like, I got this probably a week ago, and to be honest, and I hope you guys can see that. But um, so it's the tin um, for Temporal Forces. I love that card, the Walking Wake EX. I hope I hope to still get that or or buy that as a single, the alternate art one, because I thought that was so cool. But I actually couldn't find any Twilight Masquerade in the store at the time. So since I'm trying to still collect my master set, which I have some cards. I completely forgot to show you guys, but I have some cards, I have them updates, or some updates for my master set, so I'll just post that on a reel or something like that, so look out for that, but yes, so we have a lovely tin today, yes, it is not the nine packs that we usually do, or more, but um, we have, what does it say, it says five booster packs of these, so hopefully we can get some good stuff out of that, so just happy to open some Pokemon. I'm so good. Ugh, I'm so good. I can't talk today either, so I apologize. I'm so glad to be back, and I really hope you guys, over this time that I haven't seen you guys, I hope everyone is doing good. We're approaching summer. Gosh, we're already in summer, so I, I hope you guys have such fun plans for the summer. Swimming, kayaking, whatever, whatever you do that makes you happy. So, yeah, and what is it? We're two months out, three months out now from the next release release oh my gosh which is shrouded fable i think it's i think it is i'm i'm so out of it right now but yes i think that is it so i'm excited for that it's kind of a what was it it was like purple and green kind of halloweenish looking so super excited to see what comes out of that but yeah that was a lot of talking i just felt like i needed to talk for you guys since i haven't been here for a long time but as i always say let me get set up with my camera put that sucker over there we're we'll open up these five packs and hopefully we'll get some of my chases i don't even know if i should say gengar because i've been so i've been so unlucky with gengar <laughs> but yeah we'll see and we'll see you in one second all right and we're back people let's open this up and yes i did a little bit of a slit on the side because i suck at opening packs product and all of it so no cheating for me I promise <laughs> right, it's been a hot minute since I've actually opened a, t a tin wow can I talk no <laughs> so it's been a very hot minute I can't remember the last tin I actually opened to be honest but let's look at that lovely card we get in the front that is just gorgeous. And let's see here. I got some lovely masquerade. Oh wait, these aren't Twilight Masquerade. I totally lied to you guys. Oh wow, I thought these were Temporal Forces and <laughs> they're not. Sorry, I totally lied guys. I apologize. I apologize, but that is Gorgeous. We'll put that off right to here. And we got one, two, three, four, and five. Oh, so we got two Twilight Masquerade. Okay, so it's not all Twilight Masquerade. Duh. I forgot that they, I literally haven't opened one of these in so long. I forgot that they actually mix packs in here. Duh. So it's Twilight Masquerade, two of them, one Temporal Forces and two obsidian flames that's actually weird why wouldn't they just do te two temporal forces and then just one obsidian flame i don't know whatever 
I don't mind either way. Let's start off with our two Twilight Masquerade. Gosh, I'm so happy to be back to this. So happy to be opening packs with you guys. You have no idea. Get that code card out of the way. Let's get that lovely energy to the front. And we're starting off with the Psychic Energy. Put those off to the side. Put that right there. Litwick. Flabebe. I love that card. Timber. Palafin. Chiyu. Lucky Helmet. Ooh, Farfetch. The Reverse Hollow. Nice. And we got a Meg Cargo EX. Not bad. Not bad. Let me put that in a sleeve. sucker in there so we got one hit let me get these cards out of the way for you guys all right let's see what we got next in our twilight masquerade pack last one of this tin coat card out of the way put that energy to the front all right we're starting off with a fire energy Benarak, Sandshrew, oh, I actually haven't seen him like that before, oh, that's cute, or seen him in this set, I should say, my Ina, Iron Bundle, Festival Grounds, which I love this, I love this stadium one. Oh, that pincer, I love that reverse hollow nose pass, and we got a heat ran, so nothing for, tw well, we did get the Meg Cargo EX for Twilight, Masquerade, so that's not bad. And we're moving on to Temporal Forces. Please, can I get a hit from this? <laughs> Temporal Forces has a little bit been a little bit hard on me, I will say. Uh, for pull rates, but we'll see. We'll see. Deerling, Pidove, Pineco, Mowali, Vivica Volt. Great Tusk, Pineco, Mr. Mine, and we got an Iron Boulder EX, I, and I'm wondering, because I actually haven't looked at my master set yet, I wonder if we needed that card or not, I feel like we did, but I will give you more updates for my master set to see how close we are, and we are not super close at all, as I've been saying, we have been having some trouble, people, with finishing our master set, but that's okay. All right, we're on to our two Obsidian Flame packs, or Obsidian Flames. Let's see what we can get from these two. I really never opened a lot of these, but my pull rates, that the ones that I actually did were horrible. All right, get that code card out of the way, put that to the front. I can't remember, yep, there we go. So, we got a Fighting Energy. And sorry if you guys hear my AC in the background. It has been going ham for like two weeks now since the the uh, weather is so freaking hot here. Uh, oh my gosh. We got a toga kiss that actually is super cute. All right. So that is our first pack for Obsidian Flames. And this is our last pack of the tins. Or tin, sorry. to the front. We got a fire energy. Alright, we got a magnite. Bond sweet, that's cute. <laughs> Alasan. Pokemon Lake Headquarters. Lunatone. Chandelure. Oh, and we got a scissor. Scissor? Scissor? Oh, I can never say it right. See, that's why I don't say names, because I butcher them. So, for this tin, I'm trying to think how much it was. Was it like 30-something, 40-something? I mean, yes, it was a good promo up front. That's nice. But, only two hits. Meg Cargo EX and Boulder EX. So, the Meg Cargo was from... Mas uh, Twilight Masquerade, and then the Iron Boulder EX was from Temporal Forces, and we got no hits, 
for obsidian flame so not horrible always as i say it's pokemon we're opening up pokemon so it doesn't matter if we get hits or not it's fun either way and it's relaxing for me since i just i need some nice relaxing time so yeah all right guys that is it that is it for that tin which i wish i would have completely thought this through but it is not just the temporal forces tin it has twilight masquerade two twilight masquerade um a temporal forces and two obsidian flames which i thought was weird with the two two obsidian flames which anyways but yeah so we got two hits out of it three if you count the promo with it in the front so nothing that bad it was relaxing it's pokemon we all love to open pokemon anyways and just have a nice time and relax but i actually picked up and i probably should have showed this in the start of the video but why not um i picked up some stuff on the last couple weeks that i've been either going to target walmart or some card shops that i just thought just saw and i wanted so um I'll start off with, I always, I think you guys always know that I love, like, opening these little Pokemon, like, little blind figurines or whatever you get in the box, and then you don't know which one you're gonna get. So, there's a Pikachu in here, uh, Eevee in here, a Dugong, a Ivysaur, a Vulpex, and a Mew. I don't know. I thought this was so cute. Yes! It's not really spring anymore, but I mean, it's flowery. It is type of spring, it's type of summery, so why not? So that's the Floral Cup collection, which I still have to open. And then the second one I got is this one. It's the Pokemon Uta Tang uh, basket. And I'm sorry if I butchered that, that's why I don't say a lot of names, but it's kind of like a picnic type blind box. So there's Pichu and Pichu. There's Jigglypuff, there is Vileplume, there's a Sleeping Pikachu, there is a Sleeping Bulbasaur, and a Lolan Vulpex. There we go, and they're all sleeping, I forgot to say that. So, it's super cozy, super summery, super spring, whatever you will, so I'll be opening those two soon. I always love enjoying those, I just love to be surprised. And then, of course, I know these just came out, or they came out a while ago, so I got Greninja. There's also Chimchar and Snubble. I did see Snubble at Target. But I'm running out of space with my bookshelf. So maybe we'll pick up the Snubble. Maybe not. Because it's really cute, to be honest. So got Greninja. I thought he looked really super cool. And then, of course, I had to get the Munch Lax tin. I love these tins. I don't know yet if I'm going to keep it open or not keep it open, keep it sealed or I'm going to open it. I usually sometimes seal these, especially if I like the art on it. So he may get sealed depending. <laughs> and then one a last one. So I actually have the Leafeon of this one. So I got the Glaceon. I found this at Walmart. So hopefully you guys can see that if I go back a little bit, but yeah, I don't, I don't know. I, I like um, picking up a lot of this stuff that I don't know if this came with Evolving Skies, but I'm really into evolutions, so thought it was cool. I can see that there's Rebel Clash in there. There's uh, Fusion Strike, and then I'm not seeing anything else. So those are really old packs, so why not? I'm going to keep this sucker sealed as I love to keep my stuff sealed, as I said before. But yeah. So those are updates to my collection. Um, I'll probably put out like a TikTok video of, hey, look what I got, but you're seeing it first. So, but anyways, that's all I got, guys. Um, I did want to say thank you to one of my followers or my subscribers. Um, they asked, you know, what's going on with me? How am I doing? And, you know, they miss my videos being posted. I really... I really kind of needed that to be honest to like snap out of like my whole like brain fog going on with like just it being hot and then with so much going on with work and my family and stuff so thank you for that I truly appreciate you um, so yeah let me know if you love the content I always say this every video and I'm sorry if I'm just repeating myself but it truly does help um, it does help if you like it does help if you share if 
you know anyone that would like my type of content i'm at 182 followers i think right now or subscribers sorry so that's i say this every time but i still i still can't get over it that's 182 people that actually want to see what i'm posting that's that's super cool but yeah so subscribe if you haven't like if you haven't i really hope you're enjoying the content let me know if you want to see anything else i'm super up for anything but thank you guys and as always thank you so much for watching thank you so much for being here for me even when i'm not actually here so yeah i hope you guys have a lovely rest of your day and a lovely start of the week because let me tell you the weeks have been going so slow, but I hope this one goes fast for all of us. All right, talk to you later, guys. Bye.